God praise him. I'm sold out for him and my mind is made up. Also, I want to give honor to the presiding bishop of the Church of God in Christ, my man, my grandfather, Bishop J. Drew Shear. Also, I want to give honor to my beautiful grandmother, Dr. Karen Clark Shear. Also, I want to give honor to directors of this event, Bishop Patrick Wooten and Bishop Michael Golden. Thank you for this opportunity. <laughs> also to my parents, my mom and my dad. Where's my mom? See my mom and my dad's right there. Um, I want to go to a scripture today. The scripture I want to go to is the book of Exodus, the 12th chapter, yes, sir. Uh -huh. and the 13th verse to the 15th verse. And it reads, and the blood shall be to you for a token upon the houses where ye are. And when I see the blood, I will pass over you. And the plague shall not be, shall not be upon you to destroy you. When I smite the land of Egypt, the 14th verse, and this day shall be unto you for a memorial, and ye shall keep it a feast to the Lord throughout your generations. Ye shall keep it a feast by an ordinance forever, the 15th verse, seven days shall ye eat unleavened bread. Even the first day ye shall put away leaven, leaven, excuse me, out of your houses. For whosoever eat, eateth leavened bread from the first day until the seventh day, that soul shall be cut from Israel. My subject for today is look at your neighbor and say, neighbor, neighbor. I've come this far because of the blood. But before I get into the message, let us pray. Dear God, I thank you for this day, Lord. I thank you for this time. Lord, please allow this message to be a great message to the people. Lord, let them hear you through me and let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, my strength and my redeemer. And every glad heart say, amen. amen. I want to go with you, if you will, to the Bible story about Moses and when God told Moses to kill a perfect male lamb and to put the blood of the lamb on the doorpost. God led, the, God led Moses to save the Egyptians so the death angel would pass over. Well, my brothers and sisters, we have to know that the world is still crazy and the fact that you know that you're covered by the blood is just a miracle. Look at your neighbor in the eye and say, neighbor, neighbor. I'm blood covered. I'm blood covered. Well, young men of God, we should be thankful for our moms or grandmas or dads that put uh, the anointing oil on our hands or forehead before we leave our homes because it's the blood of Jesus that you're able to come to and from school. Uh, it's the blood of Jesus that you're able to wake up every morning and tell God I thank you. And because it's the blood of Jesus that you're able to sleep peacefully without somebody breaking into your home. Look at your neighbor again and say, neighbor, I'm covered by the blood of Jesus. Men of God, we have to know when God puts us on an assignment, we cannot be afraid because the Bible says in Isaiah chapter 54 and 17, it says, no weapon formed against me shall prosper. Why? Because you're covered by the blood of Jesus. But do you really want to know what's in the blood? Uh, uh, there's power in the blood. 
Pastor Esther, there's healing in the blood. Look at your neighbor again and say, neighbor, I'm covered by his blood. But as the songwriter said, there is power, power, wonder working power in the blood of the lamb. That's why when God puts us on an assignment, we don't have to fear because the blood is still covering us. Uh, the blood is still covering us even when you least expect it. The blood is still covering you even when you don't deserve it. Look at your neighbor again and say, neighbor, I'm blood covered. If God has brought you through 2019, if God has brought you through 2020, if God has brought you through 2021, now we're in the year of 2020, that is a sign that God has kept you. Uh, I'm praising God is because I'm praising God is because it is because of his blood that yeah. I can wake up every morning and tell God how good he is yeah, to me. Yeah. Uh, I just praise God today because it, it, it is so many benefits of being covered. Yeah. Uh, no amount of money that can pay Woo. for the blood. My Savior died and shed oh. his blood. Oh. Uh, Come on, Jay. You don't know. Yeah, I don't know the blood again I'm talking about. Come on, Jacob. Yeah, I'm talking about the blood of Jesus. I thank God because I'm still here and it's because of the blood of Jesus. Come on and give him a praise. Come on and give him a praise. 